welcome back. And we're actually now in New Haven. Yeah, it wasn't really much of a trip, was it? So, let's get ourselves into the actual city itself. Uh, we're gonna be here for a little while, but it shouldn't take too long. As we see, this is our port town. And still hustling and bustling. So, and of course, nice class divide. This is New Haven. Marjoram and the others should be at Strand Pier. Come on! Well, let's take ourselves a hop, skip, and jump over to the Strand Pier so we can do this. On board a ship? This is gonna be exciting. <sighs> We're performing on the ship. It'll be an experience, that's for sure. Alright, well, before we actually take ourselves onto the plot, let's explore the town a little bit. Um, as you can see, there's um, a new hairstyle around. And yes, you can get that hairstyle here. I'll be doing that during the neutral path. And the thing is, is our neutral path will be coming to a close pretty soon. Uh, since at some point we're going to have to choose good or eat, uh, fill our hero. But before that, let's uh, acquire some new clothes here. Like any good port city, we are able to dress ourselves like a sailor. We also can pick up a visor. And I'll be wearing that, and of course I'll be getting pretty much all the accessories here. Now, as you can see, my money's a little low, but don't worry, I'll get that adjusted. And now, we got our sailor outfit on, and also, with that, our album actually has the sailor outfit as well. But, we also have some new instruments to acquire. And I'll be showing these off, uh, well, I'll be showing most of these off when we actually get a chance to... In our well, for our next concert, actually. Welcome. And their selections: saxophone, drum set, and string bass. I will be showing a fair number of these off, and I'll also be showing off any other instruments that I may not have shown before. That's pretty much the only ever any time I'm actually gonna show off anything is either a new song or a new instrument, just to show you how they play and so you can hear them. So, with that out of the way, we can now actually, well, continue on with the plot. I did some buying, selling, and some other stuff, so we can get these instruments. And apparently there's a little elevator there. We'll find out the reason for that in a bit. A lot longer than we expected. Did something happen on the way? We had to deal with this Dudley guy. Dudley? I've heard of that guy. He's supposed to be a real jerk. Oh, really? Sorry to hear that. Savory and I took a little time getting to know each other better. What? Is, is he serious, Savory? I thought I told you that was our little secret. We're just kidding. Anyway, did you finish those lyrics up, Connie? Oh, yeah, sure. Come on, everybody. Let's practice. for inviting us. Oh, thank you. The whole town's been looking forward to your concert. I am expecting a flawless performance. He's certainly interesting. 
That's Don Puccini, the one who got us this gig. Well, uh, okay. Well, there's a reason why we had a little elevator there. And, of course, let's go explore the ship a little bit, because there's actually a treasure chest we need to get. And we also eat the food here. And no matter where you are, it will automatically put you to stuff. And I hope to give you a good concert. As you saw, we also got a new song. We will be playing that as part of our set now. Anytime we do a concert, any songs we have will be added to our set. That's good. 210 you are. Or er, or whatever you want to call it. I don't even know what I call them anymore. I just throw out whatever name I feel like doing. And with that, we're now ready for the concert. I'm full of food, a little money in my pocket, and let's get this show on the road. Practice? <laughs> no. As I said, they may, I can't show some of them, but I do get them a little later on, don't worry. I'll show them to you. So we're going to do the bass for right now, for the first song. Well, maybe not. No, we're going to do, we're going to do the drums for this one.
Fantabulous! I am very impressed. Thank you very much, sir. Asking you here was definitely a smart decision. You're free to stay as long as you need. I own the arena as well. Be sure to stop by when you have to die. But now, I must be going. Da.
Well, that was a nice little concert. And yeah, uh, the most difficult one to really use is the accordion because you gotta do so many things at the same time. But we still haven't heard my least favorite song. Oh boy, is it terrible. Excuse me, but I've heard rumors about you. You took on the killer elephants and beat Dudley, huh? I have a proposal for you. Just listen for a few minutes, okay? I want you to fight in a tribmobile battle. You're famous, so people will bet on you. Especially when your opponent is a wuss. That's where I come in. I bet against you, and all you gotta do is... You want me to throw a fight? Shh, don't freak out on me. You might say we're uh, fixing the game almost. Don Puccini's too cheap. He's living large, but we're paid less than peanuts. You lose, and we're rich. And there's a bonus, Puccini looks like a chump. So, you in or not? There's no way in hell I'd throw a fight. Did you think I was asking? You don't have much choice. Your friends' lives are at stake. What? You bastard! Yeah, yeah, whatever. So what's it gonna be? You'll end up doing it either way. There's not a choice here. All right, listen up. It's not that hard. I set up the match. All you gotta do is head for the reception desk. Once the battle starts, you lose. Draw gets a squat, you understand? Make sure you come to the arena later, or you know what'll happen. I'll see you later, kid. Excuse me, but I've heard rumors about you. You own the killer elephants and beat Dudley down, right? I have a proposal for you. Just listen for a few minutes, okay? I want you to fight in a tribmobile battle. You're famous, so people will bet on you. Especially when that's where I come in. I bet against you. I'd say we're uh, fixing the game almost. Don Puccini's too cheap. He's living large, but we're paid less than peanuts. You lose, and we're rich. And there's a bonus. So, you in or not? Sure, just leave it to me. You don't ask questions. I like that. All right, listen up. It's not that hard. I set up the match. All you gotta do is head for the reception desk. Once the battle starts, you lose. Draw gets a squat, you understand? Come to the arena tonight, or I can't guarantee your friend's safety. Leave Connie alone! That's insurance, see? <laughs> Later, kid. Excuse me, but I've heard rumors about you. You took on the killer elephants and beat Dudley, huh? I have a proposal for you. Just listen for a few minutes, okay? I want you to fight in a tribmobile battle. You're famous, so people will bet on you. Especially when your opponent is a wuss. That's where I come in. I bet against you, and all you gotta do is... Oh, I get it. You make a bunch of money that way. Exactly. You might say we're uh, fixing the game almost. Don Puccini's too cheap. He's living large, but we're paid less than peanuts. 
you lose and we're rich. And there's a bonus, Puccini looks like a chump. So, you in? Why not? So what's my share? Oh, so that's how it's gotta be. How much you want? Eighty twenty is ideal. Ha! No way in hell! Forty sixty or no dice! What, you're just rounding it down to trick me? Look, I don't need this. Realistically, it should be at least forty sixty. Yeah, and? I'm saying 70-30. Look, being greedy is only going to get your friends hurt, see? That's not my problem. 70-30. Take it or leave. Come on, don't you care about your friends? Nope, sorry. Besides... If Don Puccini finds out about... You play dirty. Have it your way. 30-70 it is. All right, listen up. It's not that hard. I set up the match. All you gotta do is head for the reception desk. Once the battle starts, you lose. Draw gets a squat, you understand? Make sure you come to the arena later, or you know what'll happen. I'll see you later, kid. Well, it seems that we're, our next destination has already been chosen for us. So, next time on Steambot Chronicles, the arena, will we throw the fight? Or will we just win and keep our integrity? Of course, I'm showing both. So, see you then.